okay students let us see what is there in this question the diagram shows a second harmonic standing wave on a string fixed at both ends fine what is the phase difference in radians between the particle x and the particle at y so my students it is the characteristic of the standing wave that whenever you are considering the two particles which are uh, related uh, to one segment only those particles are always vibrating together like the two particles would be zero at the same time they would be going to the maximum at the same time they will reach their amplitude at the same time although the amplitude of x might be different from y like let's say we are talking about another particle here and the particle is z so even z would be having a different amplitude like let's say this particle which is having very less amplitude let us call it r all these particles are at their amplitude at the same time at the same moment they all start falling down at the same moment they reach the zero amplitude at the same moment and then they go back downward again all together so we say that the phase difference between the particle x and y because they are belonging to the same segment that will be zero so the answer will definitely be a and what about another particle in the adjacent loop like let's say if these are x y z and r and uh, all those things so let's say there is another particle here and we're calling it a this particle is we calling it b and this particle we calling c all these particles a b c again they are in the same phase because they are belonging to the same segment but if you choose the particle y and the particle a they are completely in out of phase and what do you mean by that the phase difference is pi pi radian it means like when this y or this z is there at their crest or i can say they are at the top amplitude the particles a b c will be at their bottom amplitude okay so the phase difference will be pi so the answer in that case will be pi and also in this question you can see here that they are talking about uh, the phase difference for the standing waves and the pi is not there in the option and these all options are definitely wrong because in the case of standing waves only two phase difference are possible either the phase difference between two particle can be zero or it can be pi whichever particle whatever particle wherever they are you only the two options that we have is zero and pi so by just looking at this because they're talking about standing wave pi is not even in the option the answer is zero so we could have gone from that point of view also but i have tried to explain you each and everything for this question and even if now you're having some couple of doubts here please mention that in comment section so my dear students this is professor varun please subscribe to the youtube channel all the best